1899. Henry Schaefer is vice president at the Lakeview Brewing Company and has run his grocery store and saloon in Buffalo, New York for over 10 years, selling food and liquor in jugs like this. He must have felt optimistic about the business because within a few years he built a new building, still standing today. Had he known the future, he wouldn't have been so hopeful. Schaefer was one of many German Americans who brought brewing and distilling to the New World. But when 1914 began the First World War, American distrust of Germans turned into hysteria. In some places, dachshunds were murdered for being a German breed. The language was made illegal, citizens were arrested, and newspapers shut down. Prohibition leaders used this anti-German sentiment. They said German brewers were trying to undermine society with drunkenness and were sabotaging the war effort by using necessary grain to make alcohol. The war led to limits on alcohol production and paved the way for complete prohibition in 1920. Most breweries, including Schaefer's Lakeview Brewery, did not survive. Henry Schaefer died in the midst of the turmoil, and in 1920, a dentist occupied his building.